good afternoon happy Tuesday I am in the parking lot of a new to me post office today that I'm super excited that I found uh, I was running around to different stores this morning looking for supplies for shipping and because I'd run out of some things anyway and I did a GPS search on post offices and I found one that is really close to where I picked my son up from tennis has a drop off of 5 p.m. every day and is going to save me upwards of 40 minutes sometimes in my daily driving of to and from tennis and to and from the post office so really excited about that this is my second time here today and uh, I have the car packed up hopefully you can see some of the bins in the back I have the car packed up for tonight tonight's my uh, uh, Tuesday night knitting and crochet club and I like to bring sample garments and projects to show people what they could do with my yarns or what kind of techniques they might like to learn because I always offer free classes and free lessons at the knitting club. And I also bring samples of all my yarns for anybody who's interested in seeing the colors in person. So uh, I always pack up my car with a lot of things and the more yarns that I come out with, the more boxes I have to pack in the car, but that's okay. It's uh, kind of like having a little store and having a little classroom and we just happen to do it at our local Panera. But something that I wanted to share with you today is something that came across my radar last week and I have to say, it changed my life. And you know, I really pride myself on being a good person and as a mother I share with my child that I make the choice to be a good person when I get up every day. It's a choice that we all have to make. We could wake up and decide to be anything we want to be, including being nice or being kind or whatever we choose to be. And you know, I still have hard days and I still have days when I'm not proud of the way I behave for the entire day, whether it's getting mad at my son because he didn't do his homework the way I wanted him to do it or whatever. So I read this meme and forgive me, I don't have an author to uh, give credit to because it did not come with an author, but I wanna read this to you. It's called Check Yourself. Sometimes you are the toxic person. Sometimes you are the mean, negative person you've been looking to push away. Sometimes the problem is you, and that doesn't make you less worthy. Keep on growing. Keep on checking yourself. Keep on motivating yourself. Mistakes are opportunities. Look at them, own them, grow from them, and move on. Do better, be better. You're human, it's okay. And I found so much liberation and empowerment in this quote because to me, it meant that, you know what, you wake up every day and yes, there are things that get in your way, but what was that mission at the beginning of the day? To be the best person you can be. And it's, I just, sometimes it's easy to pretend like you didn't make the mistakes or brush them aside. Oh, well, it's because this happened or it's because that happened. The only thing that can affect you is your reaction to what's going on around you. And reading this reminded me that it's okay that I let things affect me, but it means that it's just a nice reminder to get back to what my mission and goal is when I wake up first thing in the morning. So some of you may not like this quote and that's okay. And some of you might find it ambivalent and maybe a couple of you might find it just as empowering as I did and I thought on the off chance that I could share it with someone who might need a game changer as well there it is check yourself anyway hope you have a wonderful day hope you find time to knit and crochet today and do something creative and always remember to love yourself talk to you later